give this girl your most prized possession? You let her have your dead lizard, but you got all worked up when I wanted to turn it into a barrette. <laughs> Tom, who are these people? I, I have no idea, Nancy. And for your information, total strangers, we're going to some place in the school where we actually know people. <laughs> Oh, Tom, you're so dead. <laughs> I know, right? Isn't Tom a riot? Look, Nancy, it's been a pleasure meeting both of you, but um, I need to talk to my new friend Tom alone. Okay, I'm going to Woodshop to make a shadow box to display my dead lizard. Okay. Aw, that's how it all started with me. Shadow boxes are a gateway craft. Guess what, Tom? You've been caught in some kind of lie, and I... Being the queen of all lies, need to know what it is. Oh. Nancy has been my girlfriend for a while. <gasps> oh, Nancy's girlfriend! Nancy's girlfriend! Wait, wait, okay, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. What's wrong with her? Booger eater, bathroom snacker, snort laugher. What is it? All that. That's what makes her great. She's super gross. Oh, you're gonna be together forever. Do me a favor, though. Don't tell Mom and Dad. I'm afraid they're going to do something, like, really embarrassing and then scare her away. Max, I appreciate you wanting to lie about having her parents, but changing your first name isn't going to fool anyone. Oh, no, I know. But I changed my last name, too, to Sawyer. <laughs> <laughs> Tom Sawyer? Yeah. That is such an <laughs> obvious lie. It's the name from the Rush song. <laughs> and the classic book. Wow, that song was good. I didn't know they made a book out of it. Felza! Max, what are you doing? Dad told us not to get a fortune. Oh, come on, Justin. He's just worried about us getting bad fortunes. This one's gonna be a good one. Watch. You will receive a sweet surprise. Oh, that does sound like a good one. Right. Free ice cream? Thank you. And it's called Sweet Surprise. These fortunes are extremely well detailed. Yeah, you should get a fortune. No, no, no. Just because you got a good one doesn't mean I'll get a good one, too. Okay, suit yourself. I mean, I would like to get a fortune, but Dad warned us. But then again, you did get a good one, and I'd probably get a good one, too. Probably. <laughs> Okay, fine. Stop hounding me. I'm doing it. <laughs> Zelzar. You will attract the attention of a stranger. Hey, stranger. Did you see that? She gave me the flirty fingers. <laughs> this is awesome. I know. What are the odds of you meeting a girl named Stranger? Hey, guys, look what Max is wearing. Take your jacket off and show him. No, Mom. Come on, isn't it bad enough that you know, I'm trapped inside this little girl body that doesn't even burp on command? <sighs> Max, I'm sorry Justin turned you into a little girl. You did this to me, too. And let me tell you, it feels great not being the only one in trouble for once. I dug out my favorite Alex little girl clothes, and they fit perfectly. Oh, come on, show them. Oh, I remember Alex in this outfit. You were even cuter than she was. I don't see it. Oh, you're so little with the ooh and the oh. And she's just so huggable. Wow, they really seem to miss having a little girl in the house. I'm the little girl in the house, okay? My dad and I are about to go on our father-daughter pancake breakfast. Oh, look at the pouty face. <laughs> Come on, Max. Let's go get some breakfast and have a man to boy trapped in a little girl talk. Let's go. But Dad, what about our pancake breakfast? No, we'll do it next month. Alex, I think you're being replaced as daddy's little girl. Please, I am daddy's little girl. That is daddy's little freak. So those footprints are not walking away, they're walking forward. Congratulations, fellow graduates. 
Now let's get out there and walk. Justin, are you sure you don't want to use my graduation speech? It goes like this. Later, losers. <laughs> there he is, our graduating senior. We got you some graduation presents, sweetie. Thank you, Mom, but shouldn't you wait to give me this until after I graduate? Don't be ridiculous. You're the only one of our kids we know for sure is going to make it through high school. We're excited! <laughs> it's a new briefcase. Aw, thank you. Although, technically, it's called an attache case. We know, honey. We just didn't want you running around saying attache, attache. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I got Justin a graduation present, too. Yeah, sure you did. <laughs> Good one, sweetie. <laughs> I, I think she's serious, you guys. Well, then we got to get out of here. My eyebrows just grew back from her last gift. Do you believe them? Assuming that I'm going to do something so bad that they had to leave the room, Harper, sit down. OK, now this is a little tricky because my gift is not something that technically can be wrapped. Oh, my gosh, it is fire. Stop flapping rules! Stop flapping rules! Wait, come on. Harper, you guys hear me out. OK. My gift to you mm -hmm. is that four years ago, I used magic to create a duplicate of you, and I sent him off to college. What? Yeah, and he's about to graduate. What? So basically, I just saved you from, like, four more years of school. What? <laughs> I have to agree with Justin on this one. What? Hello? Excuse me, uh, could you give me... Pan. Shakira? Yeah. <laughs> Listen, I'm on tour with the Harlem Globetrotters, and our tour bus broke down. And the only way to fix it is by singing a duet with a fan. Are you a fan? <laughs> yeah, no, we're huge fans. Really? You came at a bad time, though, because I'm crazy busy with an egg battle. <laughs> um, well, I guess then it's up to you, because if I don't sing a duet, I'm never going to get that bus fixed. Random. <laughs> My heart down the road Spend the weekend Sewing the pieces back on Crayons and dolls pass me by Walking gets too boring When you learn how to fly Not the homecoming kind Take the top off And who knows what you might find Confess all my sins You can bet I'll try it But you can't always win Cause I'm a gypsy Are you coming with me? Oh, God! <laughs> Uncle Kelbo? Uncle Kelbo! Yes, it's me! The responsible adult while your parents are away on their romantic vacation <laughs> Sister! Brother! Let's dance! Well, that bus ain't gonna fix itself. No, it ain't! 